what's good what's good welcome back to investing trade with jacks we're quickly gonna go over bitcoin it is starting to break out but we have to watch it very very closely and very very carefully so we're sitting at 40.5k we've seen a huge increase in volume uh we're up basically 10 percent. we're seeing a market cap of 70 762 billion 24 hour volume 26 billion ladies and gentlemen if you're new to crypto.com sign up to the world's fastest crypto going app grab one of the incredible visa cards for cash back in crypto free spotify netflix prime travel incentives depending on the level of card that you have 25 dollars just for signing up through my referral so we're starting to push guys this is the four hour time frame we are seeing some nice volume here However, guys, we have to be watch it very, very closely because we still have a very major level of resistance at 40.6K. See the resistance right here if I scroll back. That was a previous swing low, guys. Let me open this up. So there's a ton of resistance coming in about 40.6K. We are breaking out of our falling wedge pattern here, guys, but we have to trend very, very carefully as well as we have to watch the 20 EMA on the daily. We are breaking out of our falling wedge pattern and we have pushed above the 20 EMA, guys, but watch it very closely. There's something called a false breakout where you see some beautiful volume. It pumps up and then the bears trap the bulls and they dump the price guys so if we're going to see confirmation what i would look for is that we hold the 20 ema as support and especially if we can stay above that 40.6k that would be really bullish in my opinion and could confirm a breakout but as of right now i'm just watching it very very closely to see if we get rejected by this 40.6k level because what can happen is you have a fake out to the upside a lot of people enter long trades and then the whales stump the price. However, guys, if we can break above 40.6, if we can hold the 20 EMA, this yellow line here as support, that could start to confirm the start of an uptrend. We get back above the 55, it comes underneath, we have the bullish cross and we see a huge breakout and the correction is over, guys. However, I would definitely recommend to wait for confirmation. Wait to see if we hold the 20 EMA as well as wait to see if we can hold this this previous resistance of our falling wedge pattern let's see if we can hold it as support i mean that volume just came out of nowhere guys and we saw a huge spike on the rsi all the way towards overbought and if we look at the one hour time frame you can see we just shot right up into overbought so we would need to consolidate look at that volume guys that's the most volume we've seen in weeks here so we can see if so we'll see if we can consolidate and hold these levels or if it's just a little bit of a bull trap Watch this falling wedge, guys, if we can hold it as support, just like this, and the 20 EMA comes underneath, and we can hold the 20 EMA, and we bounce, then we could definitely see the start of an uptrend, but I'm watching it very, very closely, guys. Beautiful increase in the Bitcoin long positions, and we can see with the short positions, the shorts are falling out of the market. I'm sure some of them got liquidated on that pump there, which is a bullish indicator. If we look at Ethereum, beautiful breakout from our descending browning wedge. We have pushed back above the 20 EMA. So what I wanna see for ETH is that we hold the 20 EMA, and we hold about 2777 as support, the 20 EMA comes underneath and we bounce off that level of support. We get back above the 55 and we start an uptrend. Beautiful volume stepping in as well. For Ethereum, you can see we trend right towards overbought once again. So watch it really, really closely, guys. Your key level support for Ethereum, 2777, lucky number, guys. Maybe that's some sort of omen. And then for Bitcoin, I would keep a very close eye on about 40.6K, where I've dropped in this line here. So here, 40.6K, you can see the resistance. This is our previous swing low, now acting as resistance if we can break above it that would be pretty bullish and hold the 20 ema as support but if we do just get rejected here guys and we roll then it was a bit of a fake out to the upside trap the bulls and then the price drops lower so keep a very close eye on 40.6k that's basically it just a quick update i've just been watching it live here so i thought i would give you guys a little bit of my opinion not financial but not financial advice of course um, but I would keep a very, very close eye. I don't trust it too much until it breaks 40.6K and holds it as support. All right, guys, big shout out to the Discord. We're just talking about this breakout here. We have over 1,500 members talking all things crypto, as well as our current DCA trades and daily buy and take profit zones based off support and resistance if you want a dollar cost average into your positions. All right, guys, that's it for this one. Much love. Take care.